Thank you. This year's COVID vaccination process is creating some frustration. Not all clinics are stocking the vaccine. And if you're not paying attention, the shot, it can really cost you a lot of money. News 5's Bill Folsom is here with what you need to know. Bill. Diane, there's been a transition from government funding during the pandemic crisis. COVID vaccines are now under the private system of payment. We've heard from locals saying their clinic isn't stocking the COVID vaccine and others surprised by the cost if your insurance is not accepted. The messaging remains the same. Getting a COVID shot is important. I was just really frustrated because if this is such a still such a public health and social issue that you know, is, is deadly, is, could be life changing of the impacts of you know, not getting these things done, then why aren't they just making it really, really easy on people? Ryan Splain recently scheduled both his COVID and flu shots at his usual pharmacy. The appointment was confirmed. He took time off work, then at the counter learned the vaccines now had to be paid for by his insurance or out of pocket. And they said, unfortunately, actually, uh, we don't contract with your insurance anymore. And so if you do want to receive uh, these vaccines today, it's actually going to cost you over $200. The irritation continued when he searched government websites that are supposed to show COVID vaccine options. The end result kept showing a black screen. By calling around himself, he was able to find another pharmacy that does take his insurance. It's more of a frustrating process, so it's not what I expected. If for some reason you were running into barriers um, accessing your COVID-19 vaccine and you do have private insurance, I would recommend calling your private insurance and seeing where you can get that COVID vaccine at no charge to you. Christy Durbin, the immunization manager with El Paso County Public Health, reminds that the days of mass COVID vaccine clinics are over. With the change, she says most health insurance does cover the COVID vaccine. If you don't have insurance, your local health department and some pharmacies do have free options. Uh, we still have people who are being hospitalized and getting that COVID vaccine um, can, you know, prevent you from being, being severely ill or being hospitalized. There is plenty of vaccine to go around. Pharmacies have it. Private clinics may or may not have it because they now have to pay to stock it and then get reimbursed by insurance. Diane? Bill, thank you.